continue detention of Namdekano by APC government. It's an evil act. Just to reduce him to zero. Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. According to the news that I'm seeing today, 500 billion was released every month by Buhari's order into what they call Ministerial Humanitarian Affairs headed by Sadia Omar Farouk to reduce poverty in the country. Godwin Emefile, who was arrested by DSS, claimed that he releases 500 billion every month by the order of your former president from APC extraction, Muhammad Buhari, into a Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs headed by Sadiq. Omar Farouk, according to him, is to reduce poverty in the country. This was the lies Buhari told him. But the truth actually was, all this morning, he continued to release the in the order of Buhari was used to bribe so many people to stay away from Masnam de Kano's case. Those who don't have foresight can never see. They will continue to be around the bush. Billions of billions was used to pay and bribe so many people to plan the kidnap of Mazen Namdekano, to brought him back to Nigeria, and they continue to bribe so many people so that they will continue to keep Namdekano in DSS custody for no reason. After the court, of a P has released him. MFA was losing 500 billion every month by Buhari order without knowing what Buhari was doing with the money. Rather, Buhari told him that those money was being used to reduce. Poverty in the country. Now go around the country, even the so called north, that they claim there is so much poverty. You will find out that Buhari did not use the money to eradicate any poverty in the north. Because let me forget about the east. And the West. Because anytime you hear about Buhari paying money to use to eradicate poverty in the Niger Nigerian country, it's all about the northern part of the country. As if somebody told them not to struggle hard. As if somebody told them not to work hard. As if somebody told them not to go to school. These are people who have continued to rule this country. From the beginning to date. Upon that they continue. To squander Nigerian money. They continue to squander the resources coming from Biafra land.
because they wanted to make sure that Hebrew man is reduced to nothing. And this man called Emifi refused to ask a question. Or should I say, he was bribed too. He refused to ask, how come 500 billion naira is used every month in the name of reducing poverty in the country? Where are the people? Whom they favor with the money? Who are they? Where are they coming from? Was there anything like here? And the getting of poverty in the north, because as far as I'm concerned, you can see it clearly that if the northerners are still suffering in poverty. This is why I'm telling you today that Hey friend was deceived. They purposely allowed Buhari to leave so that they can be able to arrest him. This was APC handwork. And this is why I have continued to tell you that even your so-called president that is, was selected to rule this country called Nigeria will end up in failure. He cannot achieve anything. So far as he went into there by selection, not by electing him. These people cripple Nigerian economy. Buhari government crippled Nigerian economy in the name of eradicating poverty in Nigeria. No single thing is being seen that you can say that they did. It's all about continual making noise and you will believe that they were doing something that they did not do anything. Nigeria continue to suffer in poverty. People are suffering. Judges are afraid to say the truth because they don't want to die. They kept a gentleman whom they planned collectively and brought back to Nigeria illegally. They used the money that was being paid by the so-called central bank president or chairman, whatever he is, to use to bribe the people, so many people and so many governments in the world to make sure that they keep silent over mass nam the canon or the over Mazen and the canon continued detention after court of order has released him. And people say we should not talk. They continue to destroy my channel so that I will stop talking. But I will continue to speak. But this time around, this channel will not insult anybody again. But I will make my point without insulting anybody. It's quite unfortunate. That Namde Khan is suffering this way. What is going through? And people are busy chasing shadow. What time will come when they will come to beg him to go? Time will come when they will beg him for forgiveness. But believe me, that time we are going to know what to do. I don't think I have more to say. What I'm trying to say today is that the whole money that he may free released in the order of Buhari was used secretly to bribe so many people in the world so that they will keep quiet over Mazen and the Kano or D. Both those who planned the kidnap and those who has refused to speak 
about him. J. Biafra.